Ogden and West Bloomfield. We just got here a matter of minutes ago, and underneath that sewer grate you see behind me, there is a family of small baby ducks trapped. The call bill for action team is on the scene. We're going to try to rescue those ducks in the coming minutes. A live report is just seconds away. Stay with us. All right, a wildlife drama is unfolding right now, right in the middle of West Bloomfield tonight. Three baby ducks trapped in a drain. You did that so well. That was pretty good. Yeah, <laughs> some business owners made the discovery, and they called Bill for action. Bill, what's the situation out there? Let me sum it up for you. We just got out here, Carolyn, maybe 10, 15 minutes ago. What we have is, in that drain you see behind me, uh, three baby ducks who fell through the top of the grating and are now stuck inside this drain. They're, in fact, trapped. Now, I'm going to walk out to the drain. We put this ladder across so that we could walk out here. And you can't see them, but the three baby ducks are directly below me, about six feet down. Uh, they look just fine. Uh, they look to be healthy, but we can't get to them right now. We've got West Bloomfield Animal Control. We've got the police department and the fire department there all here right now. Uh, but we just can't get through the steel bars right here. I, I don't know if we need an acetylene torch, something we can cut through metal with or whatever, but we need to get down there to those ducks. Uh, I want to introduce you to the women who alerted us to this situation. They are standing by. Somebody take this microphone from me so I can climb. Oops. Okay, I gotta make my way across the fence here, first of all. Ah. Great, okay. Those are pictures of the ducks that are down there. Real quick, your name, ma'am. Elise Bright. Okay, tell me what happened to these ducks. What, what essentially took place? Well, the little ducklings fell through the drain uh, cover, and they've been there all day since this morning, and we were alerted by the mother duck fluttering her wings and quacking. And How's she doing? How does she appear to be? She seems very distressed, and um, we've called several agencies. No one would come to get the ducks out. So How many agencies did you call? We probably called at least five or six different agencies until we called you, and then you flew out here immediately, and we're so thankful because we have an attachment to these ducks. Of course you do. You love them. All right. Well, listen, uh, we are going to be out here working to rescue these ducks. We did it before. We're hoping to do it again. Uh, so this is Bill Spencer pointing live right now in West Bloomfield, the scene of this uh, wildlife drama that is unfolding right now. We hope to have a solution in the next half hour, um, 60 minutes, something yeah. like that. So, so, we'll Bill, back to you. so, Bill, you have called the agencies that you think might be able to help, or are we waiting for them just to to show up and, and help out? Well, I mean, take a look right over here. You'll see that West Bloomfield Fire Department is, is on scene right here. Uh, in the other direction, we've got members of the uh, uh, police department and fire department, but nobody's been able to do anything yet. Um, a, lot of, a lot of standing around, but nobody's been able to do anything. We do have an animal control crew on the uh, scene, and uh, they've got some, some uh, I don't know, some leashing uh, type gear, and we're hoping to be able to grab the ducks with that. Well, Bill, okay? we know you're going to get it done. Maybe Albert will have a new family joining him, but uh, I know the mother's there, so you all will rescue those ducks, and we'll be checking back with you, Bill. Right? All right, all right Bill, uh, get, get to work there. Save the ducks. Yeah. All right, thank you. All right. We're trying. We're oh, trying. yeah, I, I, I was, you are. I was a little worried that Bill was going to get trapped there behind that fence. We have to save Bill, but no, uh, Bill he's is, Bill is the man. He jumped over there. Jerry, you're the man. All right, let's check back in with Bill, who's been trying to save a family of little ducklings stuck in a storm drain. We're guessing it's all turned out well here, Bill. Uh, Carolyn and Steve, it happened just a few minutes ago. Millie, the wild duck, and her three babies, uh, it's a good ending. Uh, the three babies uh, were, were rescued just a few minutes ago thanks to the West Bloomfield Fire Department. What we did was we flooded that uh, drainage ditch with more water so that the water started rising and it actually uh, flooded the little ducks right out of that uh, little encased drainage hole. So they floated out to safety one by one, one, two, three, and they are all safe. And right now, they're in the retention pond right behind me, living it up, reunited with their mother. This is Bill Spencer reporting live from West Bloomfield. Oh, thanks, Bill. First Albert, now Millie, all's good. There's four ducks saved for Bill so far this year. Good, good going. <laughs>